Hey guys. So, um, I just have the title. I will explain more, but we're gonna color and talk and chat. But I want to show you guys my outfit. I was gonna get rid of these pants, but I decided against it. They're a little big, but they've been pinned to fit me for like a while, so I just put them on. And I'm wearing this outfit because it's a gloomy day, it's raining, but the boyfriend and I have a little date night tonight. And we're gonna go to the library and go to the mall and get some food and stuff. But let me adjust this actually. Okay. Hey guys, what is up? We are gonna draw because I've been feeling like coloring and drawing lately. So I brought three things. This has crayons in it and erasers and paint, but I'm not gonna use the paint obviously, so I'll probably just move those out of the way. My dog is here, Winston is here. He's down there. I'll let you guys say hi to him later, but. Anyways, I have crayons, because I thought crayons could be fun. And then I've got some pens, I guess. And there's like an expo marker in there, like I don't know. And then I have all of these Sharpies and such. But I really have been wanting to use crayons. I don't know why, but I have. Um, guys, I did my makeup and I washed my hair today and I blew out my hair. So I'm feeling like cute, but in a comfy way. And I feel like I, um, I don't know, like talking about, oh wait, backtrack, backtrack. I forgot to tell you that my, one of my besties, she commented on my last YouTube video, I think, um, saying that I should do like a chit chat, like what am I into right now? What am I wanting? Whatever. So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to, I'm going to color and just talk with you guys and tell you guys like things that I've been wanting lately, things I've been really into, what my Pinterest is looking like, and stuff like that, and then just see what kind of art I make. I got a stack of paper from the printer, and that's what we're going to do today. But anyways, now starting into it, talking about things, talking about my life lately. Talking about my life lately, I have like three jobs. Technically three jobs, but like not really. I, um, I work as a crepe maker, which is fun but also stressful because they're a brand new business and i feel like it's a brand new business i'm scared that they just like won't be able to pay me and i think it'll be fine but that's okay anyway i got my first paycheck i'm stressed out about that because it was not enough teebs but i think everything's gonna be okay and then oh so point is i have three jobs right it's a crepe making job and for that one i just wear all black Right as of right now, and I just like wear this ugly hat, and because I'm obviously making crepes, I have to like keep my hair out of the way. Out of the way. So, um, anyways, I look freaking ugly the whole time, and it's just not as cute. Like the manager, she's super sweet. She was like these the shirts that he did buy for us were even uglier, is what she said. And um, so she's trying to keep us a little bit cuter, but which I appreciate. Because I, when I was coming into like getting rid of, getting rid of, getting back from school, I was like, I want to be, I want to be able to like dress cute and whatnot. But like now I've started, I've only been working there for like two weeks and I'm starting to get to a point where I just don't put on makeup anymore because I have to be there at 11 in the morning and I just like have been sleeping in a little bit too much and I've just not been feeling it. So I've been feeling like sad because I can't put on any, any cute outfits. And I always have Tuesdays off and I feel like sometimes since Tyler isn't is working I end up doing nothing and like all my friends have jobs and like Literally, it's just like hard to find time to like do stuff So if it wasn't gloomy, obviously like I would want to be outside and I think once it starts to get warmer I want to spend more time outside. I've been really loving this like pic this idea of like a cute picnic So me and my cousins are gonna go um, Picnic on Wednesday. So hopefully it'll be warm enough but we want to go picnic and just like feel cute and slay and hopefully we can get some Instagram pictures because I just want to like feel cute for once, you know. Um, so that's kind of the goal there. I've been really into that kind of picnic idea. I've been really wanting to like up my life, if that makes sense. Like I want to kind of like bring like this sense of like self back to like my daily, like what I'm doing. Because I feel like sometimes I'll get into that rhythm where I like... I go to work and then I get home and I sit in bed or on the couch and I watch Grey's Anatomy all day and I eat dinner and then 
I go to bed and I like only wash my face when I'm in the shower and I'm not really taking the time to like do my skincare or put on makeup and whatnot. And I've been really wanting to do that, like like be really, really like meticulous about doing my makeup, doing my skincare, et cetera, et cetera. Like that's something I've been really wanting to think about and do. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at right now. I literally, my skincare seems like so basic AF though. It's like nothing, I barely do anything, but I feel like it's just one of those things where it's like, if I start, I'll start. And I've been really wanting to get into um, perfumes. This friend that like suggested this video, she's really into perfumes and I've been really wanting to get into perfumes. And I was on FaceTime with my bestie earlier. Um, she's moved to Virginia, if you guys know Gigi. Um, she's moved to Virginia and she got like this new perfume um, by Dime and it's called Seven Summer, I think, or something like that. And she said it was really good. So I wanna try to find it somewhere and maybe try it. I think maybe at the mall later, I'll go and maybe see if they have it or something and go get this, perf go smell this perfume. I can't buy this perfume because I don't have any money, but buy this perfume. And that's what I like about this video too, so I can talk about all the things that I want without actually buying any of it. Um, but anyways, I'm really into perfumes lately. I really want to kind of just go and smell more perfumes. I really want the Sol de Janeiro ones from, I want the purple one because that's the one that my friend just got. And then my other friend has like all, like they both have all of them, I think. Like, shout out Haley and Eva, but they have like all of them and they smell so good. And I only have the lotion, which reminds me, I really need to lotion my hands, but. But anyways, they, they smell really good. And I really want those ones. So anyways, into like kind of like the fashion of what I've been doing lately. I feel like this YouTube channel, this is so off topic, but also kind of actually very much on topic. I don't know what's going on. Anyways, I've been really into like the like, laundry done. The like picnic bitch of it all. Like, not like necessary, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but I'm gonna, I pulled up my Pinterest because sometimes my brain just like doesn't actually explain things well so now i feel like i have to like take a minute to look at my own pinterest and figure out what i mean but anyways okay things i've been into recently that i really 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 want i really want cute pajamas like itty bitty shorts cute little tank top little t-shirt little like cropped tee that's like gingham pajama set like i have these two button up pajama sets and i honestly should be wearing them maybe i'll wear it tonight because I feel like little pajama sets, like matching pajama sets, I fucks with so hard. I like genuinely, I feel like it would be so cute to like go to bed in a little pajama set and then wake up the next morning and like make breakfast in a little pajama set. And like I got kind of lucky because honestly, like if I can get into a routine where I'm waking up at like 7.30, like, I can still have, like, a whole morning and, like, do morning girly things and, like, um, you know, make breakfast and, uh, read and do my skincare and, like, do my makeup and shower and have, like, not just kind of feel, like, I do kind of do all that things, all of that before I go to work already, but, like, I feel like it's just not as cute, silly. Like, I don't read, I don't do anything, like, maybe... I can do more if I get up early. But anyway, my point is that I would love to do all of that in a cute pajama set. <sighs> and I have cute pajamas. Like I have a really, like, these really cute like pink brand, the brand pink. They're black shorts with strawberries on them. I love them, they're so cute. And like that with a black t-shirt, I would say would be a cute set. But I feel like matching sets is kind of what I'm really wanting. Um, I'm also really wanting like some athletic wear that's like, actually good like a good matching set because i have like a matching set right now and the bra doesn't quite fit me correctly and that's another thing like i really like to have um but have you guys seen these like striped it's like the what's really in trend right now is the boxer shorts that everybody's wearing and also like the pants i i don't know if the pants are trending quite as much but like the gingham pants or like the striped like pajama boy looking pants those i want those pants so bad so i want the gingham ones i want the i think i'm gonna make some off-brand version of the gingham ones because you know what else i've been really into lately sewing but anyways quick pause to show you my first masterpiece 
because this is all I know how to draw. I've been really wanting to start sewing. So I have a sewing machine and I have a ton of fabric because I took a bunch of tablecloths from my grandma's garage sale and she bought me also some fabric a while, like a long time ago and I haven't gotten a chance to make anything. So I took one of her fabric like thingies and I want to make it into like these shorts kind of, or not shorts, these pants, sorry. And I want to make those and I maybe, maybe them into shorts. I'm not really sure yet, but I've been really wanting to start sewing. And that's kind of on brand with like the, the gingham, the striped pajama boy kind of vibe that I'm kind of wanting. I feel like lately at least, according to my Pinterest, I'm really into loose fitted clothing. Like the other day I wore these purple pants and a, like these purple leggings and a tight shirt. And I wish that I wore an oversized shirt on top of that. And I feel like, which is really weird because I feel like I wanted to be more confident this summer and to wear tinier stuff. But I feel like I've been really wanting to wear like, if I'm gonna wear a tiny top, I gotta wear big pants. Anyways, like loose fitted clothing, like oversized like shirts. So there are these shirts that I, I can't see it in my Pinterest right now, but I've been loving them. They're like kind of like big sleeved and they tie in the front and they're very like oversized, not oversized, but like, very loose fitted and like they tie in the front and it's kind of on that gingham trend. I don't know why I've been loving the gingham thing lately. Um, these are all things that I would like to get. I don't have them, but I would like to. But anyways, that is like kind of something that I would really love to find um, or even make myself, but I'm not that skilled yet. I literally have not even made a single thing. And I'm scared to start sewing because I feel like, um, I'm scared to start sewing because I don't want to fuck it up. You know what else I've been really into? I really want a new tattoo. So do you guys want to hear what tattoos I'm going to get? I want... Me and my sister and my mom might go get ladybug tattoos. I want it regardless. I was like, I don't care if they want it or not. But my mom was like, maybe we all do it and we can get them like different. I think... So I'll see what they say, but I'm thinking maybe like... One that's like flying, one that's just like there, like another one's maybe positioned differently, I don't know. But I want one like maybe here. I've been really wanting to fill up my arms, it's kind of where I'm at currently. I really want to put some stuff on my arms because I feel like this is just not enough. And I have, I have one, two, three, four, five tattoos, but two of them are ribs and one is on my like thigh. So it's like, you don't really see most of them unless I'm either in, a, like these ones are on, I'm in a swimsuit and the other one I have to be wearing shorts. So it's like, you don't see them. As much and even like the one on my ankle, like you still don't see that one that much. And like this one you only like see because I'm wearing like a t-shirt or a tank top and it just comes out. So I just feel like I want more of my arms is kind of what I'm thinking about. But anyways, I think I want to do um, a ladybug and I've been really into fruits lately, also in t-shirt form. I really want like a t-shirt with like a strawberry on it. I really want, have it, there's this brand, I, hold on, okay, I'm getting it off topic. Let me get into the tattoos and then I'll get into like the whole fruits thing and food thing that I've been thinking about while lately. But anyways, I want a lady a ladybug like maybe here. And then I'm also wanting some fruit. And there are there is this okay, um, here's some pictures of these people. They're little people inside these fruits. I'm thinking of having my tattoo artist create her own version where it's a raspberry and it's upside down. Like cause you know how raspberries like are like the whole and then they like it's like the raspberry. Like flip it upside down, add a face and legs and hands. It's like she's wearing like a raspberry costume almost. Like and her legs are sticking out the bottom of like, or like I guess it could be considered the top of the raspberry, but the bottom like where the hole is, that's where her legs are sticking out. So it's like almost like a little elf went and like put on this like raspberry and was like wearing it. Cause I think that'd be really funny. Cause I have like a one that's like, a, it's like a girl inside a peach. And I think it's really cute when she's wearing like little boots. Like that. And maybe like my girl is wearing sneakers and that's like so cute. And I want that like maybe like back here. Cause I thought that would be cute. And I also have been really loving, it's so cliche, but like these and what it's what I'm drawing right now, like a champagne glass like situation. And I saw these ones right here, I'll put them. I'm putting pictures up a lot as we go apparently. It's gonna take me forever to edit. But I want like, maybe something would be really cute is like the one of like the champagne glass. Not a champagne glass, this is a martini glass. Like a martini glass with like the girl sitting inside. I think that's so cute. 
I think it'd be so cute. Or like a girl sitting inside and she's like holding the like olive or something. Like that would be super cute. Those are just like ones that I'm just thinking about. I feel like maybe like, I don't know. Like I feel like those are both ones where I would want them here, but I just really like this spot. But I also could put like it on my leg. Like maybe this, the martini one goes on my leg. I don't know. Those are just ones I've been thinking about lately. Me and my cousins have an idea to get one. Um, but I don't know if that's going to happen either. I don't really know. I feel like I'm really broke right now, so I can't really get anything. Because <laughs> I'm too broke. But that's kind of where I'm at right now with tattoos. I do have a lot of ideas. I do want to go get them. It's just hard out here. I don't know what to tell ya. Anyways, um, back onto the other thing. The um, I've been loving fruit. Fruit and like food. So there's this brand and it's called, oh, Lisa Says Ga. I love, I love, I'm just gonna put a bunch of pictures up of all their stuff. But like, they have like, it's like an oyster or like a martini or like something really silly goofy like a cheese, I don't know. And I have this one sweater that I got and it's a wine and a cheese on it, I think. And I've just been loving that like, like drawing of like that kind of situation. Like that is just so cute to me. I'm loving it. I've been really wanting some like itty bitty heels, like itty bitty heels. Like I just want to be like hot and slay. Like I, I don't know. I've been loving long dresses. Like if you guys saw my Instagram post, I was wearing a long dress for graduation. Oh, if you guys saw my video of me getting ready for graduation, I was wearing a long dress. I've been loving that. And like, here's a picture of this green one. I love, I want like a long dress like this. So cute. So cute. And I want like itty bitty heels to wear it with. So cute. Um, okay. So, um, one of the things she like kind of put in her comment was like books, but I, I, if you guys, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm, a Gilmore Girls fan. So this is the book I'm currently reading and there's, I'll tell you guys the books that I'm like gonna read, but I'm a terrible reader. I'm like the worst reader, right? It's, I just like don't read that much. I'm gonna read this a little bit after I'm done filming, but I'm in the middle of reading, um, Have I Told You This Already by Lauren Graham and then stories, I, it says Star stories I want to forget to remember. And I wanna like read all of her books, but I went to her book tour for this book and where is it? She signed it. But she signed a bunch of books. I was able to get one, thank God, because I love her. And it's, she's Gilmore Girls, by the way. She's Gilmore like Gilmore. And by Lauren Graham, and I'm gonna, so I'm gonna read that one, and then I wanna get her other books too. And then um, the actor who played Emily Gilmore is releasing a book called The Third Gilmore Girl. And I really want to read that one too, because I just like love the lore of everything and I just want to know. So that's also something I'm reading. I'm going to read, I need to finish Atomic Habits. And I kind of, that's also kind of like, I'll talk about some of my like just life goals, I guess. Like my New Year's kind of resolutions, but not really at all because it's May. But, um, oh, the other books I was reading, I was looking at my notes. And then I want to read The Gifts of Imperfection. I was listening to a podcast called Moments. It's the Moments podcast. I've been loving it. I love her lately. She's very grounded, I feel like, and I've been loving that kind of energy. And I just feel like I've been needing that kind of energy. So I've been listening to her a lot. Um, and she was talking with someone, I can't remember, but they, she was like, I think every woman should read this book. So if you've read it, comment down below, let me know what you think. But I want to read it. I'm going to look for it at the library today. So those are kind of the books that I'm aiming for. I want to finish this book. And then I'll probably go back and finish the Atomic Habits when I get a chance. But I also want to read the other book. And if we're going to the library today, I may want to just start reading the other one. But this one's a little more just like stories. So I could probably just like read a chapter when I feel like it. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at, but books wise... Anyway, sorry, I can't, I'm realizing like through this is that I can't really talk and draw at the same time. But this is kind of like the progress of this one. I don't know, drawing a cheese, um, a red cheese. And 
I don't know. I've been like just living, loving my life, loving my life. I have a like abundance of clothes. Like my clothes, I have so many. And I have so many pairs of shoes because I really feel like I want to be the most fashion girly I humanly possibly could. The problem is I'm struggling with is that I literally, okay, so there's some like influencers where they have, I gotta keep drawing. I They have um, fucking just tubs of clothes in their closet. And I was like, I can do that. Like put my nice stuff up in the closet. And then, cause I have, honestly, I'm taking up 90% of the closet space. So I can put the nice stuff up in the closet and then just put everything else in bins. That's kind of where I'm at. But obviously, like, I can't just do that because Tyler lives here, too. And, um... Oh, food. There's this trend going around with the cottage cheese and, like, an egg. And then, like, you bake it in the mic In the oven. You bake it in the oven. You bake it in the... You bake it in the oven, and then it's, like, a wrap. And technically, that would be gluten-free. So... I really want to try that and I want to like start making wraps and things instead of just like eating nonsense or like not eating at all because I feel like I don't eat that much in a day and that's worrisome because I was feeling really lightheaded the other day and I think it was because I just hadn't eaten anything in a while. Okay so things I've been thinking about a lot actually I'm gonna say I like i've been dancing a lot i've got some really big fun things coming up i want to i'm gonna do two different auditions and i'm starting my own mini modern company thingy and that is gonna be interesting and i feel like i feel so good when my hair is clean <sighs> um some random thoughts i'm gonna say that i really want wide leg pants i've been really into wide leg legged pants right now and i ran out of jeans so i have to get a new pair of jeans probably soon just because mine are falling apart but i've been really wanting wide, like just like a good thick pair of like wide leg pants and i feel like with the summer i want to be really more into sundresses like like more flowy i feel like i like i said i've been really i feel like this is the summer and the time of loose fitted clothing like i'm kind of just like almost hippie like see like this is just like kind of brilliant kind of an artist let's do another one with a highlighter and then maybe we'll call it a day. <sighs> okay, we're gonna use this pink marker. Okay, last things that I guess I don't really know what else to say because I feel like right now I'm in such a rut. I feel like my Pinterest, there's my Pinterest and I want things and like I kind of, most of my vibe that I've been kind of like thriving for lately is that kind of like European thing. Like I just kind of want to I just kind of want to, I don't know, I don't know, and as I'm, I kind of will, here, I'll like end on a high note and talk about kind of like more, I feel like right now I'm in kind of like a weird spiritual journey, spiritual journey where I'm kind of just like, kind of trying to decide like how I'm going to achieve my goals, because I've always wanted to be like this kind of like it girl like she dances and she's making a name for herself and she's a youtuber and all that kind of thing and i feel like i feel like i'm struggling to kind of get myself there and i'm kind of like in this core more spiritual place where yes i want i want to look like that and i want to wear those clothes and i want to do this 
but I'm like, how do I do that now with the stuff that I currently have? And I've got like, you know, I want to start sewing and I'm, I'm going to try to like build that sewing thing up so I can kind of, I don't know, have like that wardrobe, I guess that similar thing, but my point is that I feel like right now because I'm so little on money, I kind of just want to get myself into a routine where I am feeling successful and happy and I've got a good chunk of clothes. Like right now, obviously like I'm running out of jeans, like my jeans don't, aren't looking too great, but like, but like that's like, you know, I'm kind of like, I'm adulting it at, at, in the fullest. So I feel like I'm kind of in the place where I wanna just like build, I'm building, I'm building blocking. I don't know. I'm like kind of being spiritual, not spiritual. I'm building really inspirational right now, but I'm kind of at a place where I'm building and I'm like finding the foundation for stuff because I know that right now I am not able to kind of just go get these things. So I have to like build first. So I'm gonna build and then be able to put myself in a position to be the it girl that I've always wanted to be and be the person who can go get these super cool items and stuff. But I feel like as much as I'm a material girl, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with that. So I'm gonna try to wrap this up somehow, but here's my last one. Um, I'm gonna try to wrap this up. I'm not really sure where this went, um, but I appreciate you guys doing this journey with me. Um, I'm gonna say that like, I love things and I hope that you guys like seeing the things that I'm interested in right now. So there's my Pinterest. There's the things I've been thinking about lately. Um, I feel like right now my biggest goal, like where I'm currently at is to, I have a, I got a new perfume for Christmas and I wanna use it and I wanna love it and I want to like start thinking about what kind of things I could add to like that collection. I want to start branching out with makeup as soon as I can, as soon as I'm able to kind of do that. I would like to do that. I really want to start sewing and like I kind of want to use the inspiration of some of the stuff that I've been looking at on Pinterest lately to kind of build what I'm going to start sewing because I feel like a lot of the stuff I have been looking at is something that I could theoretically probably make pretty similar items to, um, especially with those pants. So that's kind of where my kind of goals are right now. And I really just want to try to build a really good routine, like an it girl routine. That's where I'm kind of at right now. I really want to build an it girl routine. I want to be able to wake up, have a nice breakfast. Like I want to have like eggs and a sausage and have a really nice breakfast. And I want to sit at the counter and I want to go sit in my vanity and do my makeup and read a book. And I want to like have like this it girl routine. And I've been trying to give myself rules. I've been giving myself rules to have a successful week. And to have a successful week, I want to have one outing, whether it be by myself or with a friend. One outing where it's like, okay, I'm going on a picnic, or I'm going to the library, or I'm going around the mall, or I'm going to a friend's house. Like, something that's not work, or like, going grocery shopping. Like, something, like, an outing. I want to have an outing, whether it be by myself or with a friend or with the boy. I want to do an outing, and I want one date night with him. One, the boy, I don't know why I said him. No, the boyfriend, Tyler. I wanna have one date night where we go do something fun and that also could literally be like bouldering, but like planning it out. Like a date only counts if you planned it out in advance. Like tonight we're going down a date night and we're gonna go see a movie. But we planned this out for like probably four or five days. And I would say that's a date. Even if it was like, we're doing this at home, but if it's like, we're gonna color or we're gonna watch our show and do this or like whatnot, but it has to be planned out. It has to be planned out or else it's not bait. So those are kind of like my so far my rules. I'm gonna kind of work on build them up. I feel like a part of my rules would also be like kind of trying a new food or like eating something that made me feel good because I feel like that's the thing that also I'm like really lacking with. But I don't know. These are kind of things I've been thinking about lately, things I've been wanting, things I've been 
kind of goals I'm working on, things I'm working on. I don't really know what I'm going to title this video, but I hope it was fun to chat with you guys and for you to listen. And if you guys have any advice, if you guys have anything you're working on, anything you've been loving, comment them down below. Let me know. DM me on Instagram. I don't really know. I'm down to chat with y'all if you're interested. Just tell me. Tell me what's up. Um, but I hope you guys like this video and I will see you guys next time in like two days probably.